I'm Emily, I'm 23 and I'm from Mildura in Victoria and I'm here for Peter's Retreat. Uh, thanks Emily. So here we are on the steps of your beautiful beach house. Yes. You, uh, listen carefully, you can hear the waves in the background. And, um, you know, what were, were your expectations before you came? Well, Auntie Kath came two years ago to your retreat and I think she got home and she just talked about it for ever. And, um, yeah, I think she ended up just saying, oh, Em, I think you'd really benefit from it. And I kind of had no idea really what it was all about. I knew there was a meditation aspect and meditation was kind of something that I'd always thought about maybe wanting to try um, never knew where to start uh, and I knew there was an NLP aspect and had no idea for the life of me what NLP was um, and I knew there was a yoga aspect and I have done a little bit of yoga in the past and so that kind of drew me in as well and then I was a little bit lost with direction and passion like just not really sure where I was going and I think I had the mentality that I had to know kind of thing I just had to know what I was gonna do um, but through the NLP and one-on-one -on -one sessions I've come to realize that I don't need to know and I have all the tools within inside me to get to where I'm meant to be and make the decisions that I need to make to move forward rather than just staying in the same spot where I have been for the last few years after school because I was scared to make any decisions and scared to try and scared to commit and scared to make a um, make a move in the direction of where I want to be. One of the things that I did in the one-on-one -on -one session was I was asked to visualize things not as me as another person and then Mana asked me what I would say to this person and I would say you're okay you're a great person rah, rah, rah. and then so she kind of then turned it back on to me and was like well why aren't you saying this to yourself and then yeah I think the penny kind of dropped in that aspect and I was like well yeah why aren't I saying this to myself so lucky we've got a beautiful ocean just out there behind me this way and my beautiful hut back here and yeah we've had little Bella the toucan coming up and sitting on our step every morning um, we've taken the paddle boards out in our free time in the ocean snorkeling spa treatments all that um, but also the social aspect we have had the most awesome group of what 13 people I think we had and everyone's different we're all of different ages I'm only 23 so I was the youngest of the group and I didn't feel young like that I just felt like I fitted in with everyone and yeah we're all able to connect really well um, so this has been an amazing experience to share with my auntie and also my cousin Steph is also here as well and I think it's just made it that little bit more comfortable having the family bond so yeah I definitely recommend it to any family members who want to do it together it's definitely brought us a lot closer even though we were close before with I guess we found out things about each other that we didn't know before and we're in an environment where we can share openly and we've felt comfortable to share openly um, so yeah I'd recommend it to them for sure I also would recommend it to young people I like I said only 23 um, and I wasn't really yeah it wasn't really sure if it would be for me kind of thing but I think a lot of the things I have learned have been so useful for me at a young age I think even if I had have learned it back in year 12 I would have really benefited from it in the last five years leading up to now but yeah I'm really grateful that I'm learning all these things now and I can continue it and yeah 